Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to make a short video review of this uh, mini projector from TGQ. I'll get you to the unboxing, I'll show you how to set it up, but the most important, I'll show you what is the video quality. So guys, make sure to stick till the end where I'll share my honest thoughts about the projector. And guys, if you find this video helpful, I'll really appreciate if you can tap the like button, also consider to subscribe. So let's get into the video. And this other box looks like nothing impressive. Uh, I was expecting for this projector to be a bit bigger, uh, but uh, this is the size of the box, obviously. On the other side, more or less same thing, but the most important is to see what is inside. Here, I suppose, is the projector. Really nice protected with uh, foam. We get a power cable over here. HDMI at both ends. Here we get the audio cable. And this other remote control looks like a pretty clean design. Mind that you will need the batteries for it, triple uh, A. And this is how the projector looks like. Uh, this is the first overview. Here we have the buttons uh, for the menu. Here is a nice uh, branding. Uh, here at the front, this is uh, the lens, and uh, I suppose this one is a, um, a small sliver. To adjust uh, the focus, uh, you have to use this wheel. Uh, here at the back is the ventilation, another receiver, and uh, port. And uh, here on the side, ventilation, uh, you have the power um, supply, we have the HDMI regular a, uh, USB A, the old type, and uh, these ones are for the audio. And uh, here at the bottom, uh, we have uh, four anti slip legs uh, to keep this steady on any type of surface. So, this one is super easy. The first thing that we have to do is to insert the uh, HDMI uh, cable into the computer. And after that, I'm going to uh, add the plate of my tripod because I want to set up. Uh, this uh, mini projector on the tripod for a better viewing experience and uh, then the next step I have to attach the uh, HDMI cable you know the power cable which goes over here now that I have this set up uh, this is uh, what uh, the mini projector sees and now I have to uh, select uh, the HDMI in my case because I connected to the computer and in order to do so I have to use the buttons to navigate and I get the HDMI and I'm gonna press OK and yeah, it took a bit of time, but the most important is that uh, I can see uh, what my uh, the desktop of my laptop, and I'm just going to adjust the uh, focus. And now is the best. And this is the video quality, guys. Uh, for considering the small size of this uh, project, uh, I consider that the quality is really good, and as well. Uh, I'm gonna do something now. I'm gonna in, uh, decrease a bit the volume. You can do it uh, using the buttons on the projector or using the remote control. Now I have reduced the volume to zero for you guys to hear um, the ventilation. I'm gonna put the microphone a bit closer. I have here a scale, I set it to zero and I'm just gonna place the projector and it weighs 327 grams, which is unbelievable how small and light can this one be. Now some thoughts about this uh, projector. The resolution is 800 uh, by 480. It supports a maximum resolution of uh, 1080p. Um, the light of, uh, of it is a LED and uh, uh, it's recommended uh, to use it at a distance uh, between uh, 1 to 5 meters. Uh, the aspect ratio is 16 by 9, pretty uh, usual. Uh, and the video input uh, is, uh, as you guys can uh, see in the video, is uh, HDMI or uh, you can use a USB as a storage. And the speaker, as I said, is 2 watts, uh, kind of powerful in my opinion. After I had this chance to test this uh, mini projector for a couple of hours uh, and making some tests with it, uh, I came to the conclusion that considering its size and uh, how light it is, it delivers a really good uh, video quality. Also, the sound is fine. Uh, it's uh, super easy to use. It also comes with a remote control. So overall, I recommend you to buy it or to drop it. Well, guys, definitely to buy it. If you have any questions related to the product, you can leave them in the comment section below and I'll answer. There's also a link in the description where you can check out more information about this. Thank you for watching and see you next time.